Wilhelm von Nifausen, a German military officer, played a significant role as a general in the British Army during the American Revolutionary War. His leadership, tactical acumen, and involvement in key campaigns shaped the course of the conflict in North America. Nifausen's contributions, although overshadowed by more prominent figures, were instrumental in several pivotal moments of the war. Early Life and Military Career Wilhelm von Nefausen was born on May 5, 1716, in Nefausen Castle, Germany, into a noble family with a long tradition of military service. He received a comprehensive education and pursued a career in the military, rising through the ranks of the Prussian army. Known for his disciplined approach and strategic thinking, Nefausen gained a reputation as a capable commander. Service in the American Revolutionary War Arrival in America In 1776, as part of Britain's efforts to suppress the rebellion in its American colonies, Nefausen was dispatched to North America with a contingent of Hessian troops to bolster British forces. His arrival coincided with a critical phase of the war, as the British sought to assert control over key strategic locations, including New York City. New York Campaign Nefausen played a prominent role in the New York Campaign of 1776, serving under General Sir William Howe. During the Battle of Long Island in August 1776, Nefausen led Hessian forces in a successful flanking maneuver that contributed to the American defeat. His disciplined troops played a crucial role in securing British victories in subsequent engagements, including the capture of New York City. Philadelphia Campaign in 1777, Nefausen participated in the Philadelphia Campaign, where British forces aimed to capture the rebel capital. He commanded the left wing of the British Army during the Battle of Brandywine in September 1777, where his forces played a decisive role in the British victory. Nefausen's leadership and tactical skill were evident throughout the campaign, although the British ultimately failed to achieve their objective of capturing Philadelphia. Return to New York Following the Philadelphia campaign, Nefausen returned to New York City, where he assumed command of British forces in the absence of General Howe. He faced the challenging task of maintaining control over the city and surrounding areas while facing increasing resistance from American forces. Nefausen's leadership during this period was marked by his efforts to fortify British positions and repel American attacks. Actions in New Jersey in 1778, Nefausen led British forces in several engagements in New Jersey, including the Battle of Monmouth in June 1778. Although the battle ended in a tactical stalemate, Nefausen's disciplined command helped prevent a complete rout of British forces. He continued to play a prominent role in the defense of New York City and surrounding areas throughout the war. Later Years and Legacy after the conclusion of the American Revolutionary War, Nefausen returned to Germany, where he continued to serve in the military. He died on February 6, 1800, in Germany, leaving behind a legacy of service and dedication to his country. Wilhelm von Nefausen's contributions to the American Revolutionary War, although often overlooked, were significant in shaping the course of the conflict. His leadership and tactical skill helped secure key victories for the British Army and maintain control over strategic areas in North America. While his role in the war may not be as well known as other figures, Nefausen's service remains an important part of the broader narrative of the American Revolution.